Hi, welcome to Everyone Can Jam. This is a place where everyone can learn to play music, and the thing that started this whole project was stories I would hear about a time when everyone was a musician, and places still where everyone is a musician. And uh, if you visit there and they ask you to sing and you say, ooh, I don't sing, they say, well, they just don't understand it. They say, how can you not sing? You can talk, can't you? And uh, so this made me really interested uh, about these times and places. And I wondered, how does it work or how did it work when everyone was a musician? Well, one thing I've come to realize is that about 500 years ago, our music became much more complex than it used to be. And we began to have people who were far more developed musically than other people and we began to um, call them virtuosi or virtuosos and we would start going to concerts and buy tickets to see them and and that's all well and good um, but something we need to watch out for is just this notion that um, they are musicians and we are not um, or that I don't get to because I'm not good enough, that sort of thing. Everyone is a musician and music is basic human expression. So, um, gee, <laughs> that was a long speech. Really what I came here to say today is um, uh, it's a practice strategy. So when people sign up for my email list, um, they have an opportunity to tell me about something they've struggled with. And something I've heard about is uh, when folks practice quite a bit but feel like they're not progressing. And so a few of my videos are about practice strategies because definitely there's things we can learn about how to practice. And one of the things that helps our practice is knowing that we can improve everything when we focus on one thing. So how that looks uh, when I'm working with a student, say they're a strumming a song that goes like this, and there's some words and they want to sing. Um, what we do is we don't try, if, if it's a beginning student and, and it's the first time they're strumming and singing, um, we don't always try to sing and strum together. I'll record a video for them, um, uh, something like this. Stand by me, oh, stand by me. And I'll record the, the whole song for them, and then they can listen to that song, and they can practice only the strumming. They're focusing on the strum. But they're hearing the words uh, and the music, so it's all going in there, and their brain is taking notes. And then they also practice listening, not strumming, but singing along. And they'll just sing, stand by me, and they're hearing the strumming, and it's starting to fit together in their brain. And then eventually, um, they can strum and to sing, and that works really well. So that's just one example of how you can improve everything by focusing on one thing. And uh, if you'd like to join my email list, you can go to www.everyonecanjam.com because I always put things there that I won't put every anywhere else. So I hope to uh, see you soon, bye-bye.